Jason. You are being reckless. Don't lecture me out. your mother? Brother talk? Oh, you're all business. I bet you wouldn't even be bothered to give a reach around. Pity. The last one had some manners. Does the big man not cuddle you when he's done? You're talking a big game over there, Pennywise. Again, why am I here? Patience! Patience, boy blunder. I don't want to spoil all the fun. This isn't the best fun house, but it'll do in a pinch. And I brought you here for a very special reason. But I want to talk to you first. Can we do that, sweets? Nah. I never put on on a first date. Oh, where's the fun in that? Fun? You want to have some fun? Let me out of this chair and then we can dance our way back to Arkham. Oh, they do know how to have a good time there. I know how to show people a good time when they come to my city. city. Oh no, sir, how very wrong you are. This city owes you nothing. I could throw you in front of the monorail and no one would give a second thought to the spandex splat on the wheels when it rolled into the next station. If anything, he and I own this city. This has always been our little playground. You're just a toddler who shits in our sandbox. <laughs> oh, I am more than just a toddler. I'm more than that, and I'm more than him. <laughs> You're in no position to be making threats, little one. You know he is coming for me, right? You really think you're like him? Well, the sad fact of the matter is you're really not. This get-up of yours is a very bad joke. There is someone beneath this mask of yours, true. But I have a problem with masks. I'm me, through and through. And although he plays his part, at least he has the decency to show me his true face. You're not real day or night, Jaybird. Take off that gloomy mask of tragedy. It's not your style. And that Fins me! He is mine. And you are just holding him back. I am the rock to his Sisyphus, destined to make him fail and accept the cruelty of the world and the frailty of his mind. And you are just the sand in his shoes that only makes him slower. But you're gonna help me. <laughs> what are you talking about? You get to redeem yourself for all the traction you've made him lose by being his ultimate loss. And then he will finally, finally understand. So kill me, huh? I've always wondered when you would start trying. It's always been fun in games to you. <laughs> oh, flattery will get you nowhere. Well. Even if you are rude and ill-mannered, I'll admit you're full of spunk, kiddo. Is that his doing too? Code or no code, he will put you down. My familial ties are always the easiest to break. Wrapped up in those fragile little heartstrings. You know, it's true what they say about the sins of the father. And you. 
the great boy wonder are the prodigal son. But you're also a piss poor sequel. And if Father Abraham won't finish the job, then I will gladly play my part. <laughs> Sorry to cut off your punchline, but you know. <laughs> My life's gone. And no songbird is singing. <laughs> Oh, you're funny. Oh, I didn't know I'd find you so humorous! Oh, you're getting me riding my funny boat! <laughs> Jason! You are being reckless. Don't lecture me, Al. All your training. All he's given you. He loves you, Jason. He doesn't give a damn about me. He loves you like a son. We all know who the real son is. Look, I, I don't deserve this, okay? I'm just as good as he is, if not better. No. You are your own man, Jason. You cannot be broken. Your past does not define you. Nor does your anger. You are part of this family. and we protect family. Until the end. Oh, oh, don't go crying on me now. We're not even in the best part yet. <laughs> oh, do I have some gags for you tonight? I think you'll like them. Besides, who knows a punchline better than me? <laughs> Have it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're coming. <laughs>